the last uh, operation we're going to do with the for loop for now is going to be the sum. And we're still in 7.5. So let's just go ahead and grab this entire method. We'll put it at the top here. All right, so it's going to take a double array. I'm going to change to an int array. And then we can do int zero. And everything else should work OK. So what's this going to do? Well, it's going to create a variable called total. Um, you can call it result if you want to, but this one mathematically is going to be a total. What is total going to do? It's going to be equal to itself. Sometimes it's easier to read if you don't use the shortcut. So it equals itself plus the value at position i, and it's going to return total. So we'll duplicate this line, control shift down. I'm going to comment out the first one. Total of So we're going to use not the search, we're going to use the sum, and sum only takes one uh, parameter. All right, I would like to see the array as well. So I'm going to go and use the uh, array to string. So we'll see the total of, we'll see the array printed out, and then we should see the result of sum. We won't need that anymore. Total is, all right, why did I do 15.0? Oh, because I said we're going to return an int, or a double there. So we're going to actually return an int. So the total is 15. Let's get crazy, change some numbers. All right, so there's that new total right there. So that is how to do a sum.